we are working on designing a handgun detection model that works on detecting handguns such as pistols in videos. We need the model to be as accurate as possible and as fast as possible because we need detection to be done in real time. was really the idea of my student. I remember a discussion with him. He told me, Professor, in Mexico, there is a big problem with the, with the arms. We said, OK, we're going to start the project. My name is Siham, and I'm a senior researcher at the University of Granada. These Hollywood movies were the best example for us to test our model. Yeah, this scene is really good. We tested the, the model on films, different images, different examples that had a handgun in it, or a person handling a handgun, Pulp Fiction, Mr. Bean. When you have a film, usually the image, there is a big distance between the camera and the stand. And really, in this scenario, really the, the pixel with the arms, in some cases, are very reduced. In Bank Collaborate, the system check the image when they detect an arm in the first frame. The decision is to check a sequence of five frames. The system is looking for an object that looks like a pistol in the scene. And once it finds uh, that object, it put this green rectangle in it in the frame. So the system is quite sure that object is a pistol in very consecutive frames. In all consecutive frames appear the person with the arms, then our system send an alarm. We also trained it to recognize all the objects that can be handled similarly to, to, to the pistols, such as smartphone, uh, wallets. Uh, as you can see here, the system detected a wallet in this region of the image. If you have an alarm with the system, the person in charge of, 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 of the system need to check the image to avoid any action with a false uh, alarm because they suppose an, uh, a, ch a child with, with an, a toy pistol. The, the person can take action checking really the video. Now I think that the collaboration uh, between artificial intelligence and, and the people, the humans, is really a good way to use it. Really a combination of machine learning, big data, is really an, an interesting scenario for the, for the future to develop more and more new intelligence systems.